Bonjour, welcome to the Dahlia Society. Parlez vous français? Oui! No, actually, I don't speak any French. No, I don't either. <laughs> actually, you did in high school, didn't you? Oh, that's a long time ago, I've forgotten now. It's I like know, me. I know to take the dog and the cat. <laughs> that's a bad idea. Well, I thought you guys would like to see a bit of beautiful French fabrics. Actually, they just got off the plane this week and were delivered to me to show you guys some beautiful couture viscose prints. Um, I can't wait to show you. But before I get started, I'm going to tell us what we're both wearing. Actually, yeah. Mum, you can go first. What are you oh, wearing? This is a rock melon, uh, Terry. Yeah, I'll take this. Um, I think it's called the Sweet Cheeks Pattern by Pattern Emporium. That's right. Yes. It's our French Terry we have French in the shop. Terry. That's right. And I am wearing the dress that I haven't actually shown you guys yet. I've just finished whipping it up. It's a really easy t-shirt dress with a nice drawstring waist. And I've made it in that beautiful um, stoff cotton knit jersey fabric, which is the Hummingbird song. Mm -hmm. So I've shown you guys that just a little while ago. But it's really pretty on, and I think this dress is going to be great. It's going to be perfect for wearing for summer with some little Converse kind of trainer shoes. So we've been really busy, haven't we? Yes, very busy. You know what we've been doing? <laughs> Packing the boxes and <laughs> advent calendars. Calendar boxes. I think uh, Mum and I are just... Our brains have been so focused on like packaging, Make, making sure that everything's in there, <laughs> re making double chan, double, <laughs> double checking, counting, recounting, making sure that all twelve numbers are in there, and they are almost ready to be shipped off in another week. Yes, yeah, so. yeah, so I think they will be ready. <laughs> so I can't wait for you guys to see them. But um, we're here today to bring you some brand new fabrics. Um, before I get started, as well. If any of you have purchased bespoke boxes, know that if you want to combine post um, and put any of these new fabrics in there, we are going to be able to combine them quite easily. Um, just use the code combine bespoke and you will have your shipping taken off so you can put it in with your box. It just means that you'll be able to um, get the fabric posted out without having to pay double postage, um, mm -hmm. but you'll have to wait maybe a few more days um, to make sure they both come together. But that way it saves you guys a bit of money. Now, I know a lot of people do email me each month to ask if they can put yeah. fabric in, and yes, you can do that. Uh, for overseas orders, I just need to make sure that they're not over the weight threshold. So let me know, and I'll give you a quote and tell you exactly the postage amount um, before we finalise um, all that kind of thing. So, yeah, um, there's good. lots to go through here. So okay. the whole new French brand we have here. Um, it's really exciting because we had the least tailor, which was um, last month that you guys all snapped up. A lot of it sold out. And I saw this beautiful new couture Cosette brand um, viscose, which is just stunning. Now, all these viscoses are Eco Vero, which means they are sustainably sourced or sustainably forested um, wood, which means normally um, bamboo and eucalyptus is what they use the pulp from to make the, like a regenerated mm, fibre. So viscose is a natural fibre. It's a sustainably um, sourced viscose. It's made in France as well. Beautiful quality. Uh, I just thought these colours are amazing. Have a look yeah. at that one. That one's called Simone or Simon, and it is a beautiful – each of these um, each of these fabrics is from a collection that Cosette will bring out. And, um, yeah, the Simone mm. is just lovely. So I'm going to hold it up. Um, I'll get you to hold that for me, Mum. Mm -hmm. I'm going to bring up to the camera and show you the colours. Hold that up so you can see the beautiful drape. The viscose itself is just such a stunning quality and stunning um, weight and softness. So really, really pretty. The colours in that are just um, such beautiful jewel-toned print colours. And look how nice that would look mm. at a beautiful shirt dress. But I, um, I thought straight away I needed to have that in my store for you guys to um, to possibly make up. I'm thinking a beautiful blouse, be gorgeous in that, or even a maxi dress or even a shirt dress. Mm -hmm. um, there's so much you could do with that. Um, pattern Emporium, of course, are coming out with their brand new shirt dress pattern just this week. It's going to be released um, on Thursday night to be able to purchase. And even that would make a stunning shirt dress so it'd be so beautiful um it's a really nice scale print too so not overly oversized and it has that really pretty kind of uh watercolor paint effect so I like the colors in that yeah beautiful really really pretty lovely colors so that's the summer dress definitely mm. 
Um, now, if you love autumnal colours, this is a beautiful bouquet in it. And it is the new, uh, of course, the new Cosette brand as well. Uh, the colours in that are just stunning. And I know a lot of you love those earthy autumnal shades. It's got really, really pretty um, the mustards and the blush, um, the kind of watermelon colour as well. And I can definitely see that in some kind of shirt dress. What do you mm, think? What would yeah. you make with that? Mm, probably a nice top. The top, sort. yeah, like a floaty top even. Yeah. Um, even the um, Patton Emporium, is it the Meet You There, the woven one, that would be beautiful as well. Mm. Or a swingy style, like trapeze top would be nice. Mm -hmm. um, that's actually really your colours. Oh, is it? Yes, definitely. Autumn colours. Autumn, yeah. But look at the drape. That's one thing. Uh, I think the French fabrics, uh, although they're a little bit priced, yeah, you can definitely see the uh, value, quality. the quality yeah. is just mm. beautiful, just stunning. But a couple of people asked me about caring for this kind of fabric as well. Remember, cool, gentle machine or delicate like hand wash. Don't put it in the dryer. Don't tumble dry. Um, you're best to hang it to dry and it won't crinkle mm. up as much. There won't be as much ironing needed, but a really pretty uh, summer fabric Even or spring. skirt definitely a teal mm. organic skirt would be mm. beautiful in that one too that one's gorgeous this one is so pretty as well i love the navy background it's mm. called the sherry chestnut um it's a really really pretty they're all woven viscoses mm -hmm. the color in that is really stunning i think a dark background with a bright vivid print and it's a really nice scale print as well have a look at the size of it so compared to my hand there um, I think a lot of you guys love to see the fabrics in person to see how swishy they are and how they move as well. So um, I think that would be also really stunning in a, a shirt dress. Even the um, Megan Nielsen, the new pattern that she released, the Protea pattern, which you get a five-piece ensemble as well. Um, mm. A blouse I think is also beautiful, even a nice um, itch-to-stitch v-neck blouse would be really, really pretty. Um, but Cosette patterns also have their own um, pattern brand as well. So if you would love to see those stocked in store, I would mm. love to be able to bring them in for you as well. So that one is the Cherie Chestnut. Now I love how they are all in um, this particular brand have got their own collections. This is from the Colour Therapy Collection and it is called Mirage. And this has a really lovely black background with really bright fuchsia magenta print and it is like a really unusual geometric floral. I love a bit of abstract mm. floral, a really nice vivid print. Uh, you can also see, I'll put a pick up so you can see exactly how it looks in the blouse pattern um, that they have got out. It really, when you see it against the body, um, made up into a garment, it really looks gorgeous. So I think that would be stunning in some kind of top. Um, even a wrap dress, the new named pattern wrap mm. dress would be gorgeous. Uh, or the so different um, gorgeous new wrap dress as well with the curved front and curved dress. So very imagine that colourful. for party season. Yeah, very colourful. Very nice for like Christmas time, festive kind of dress. A lot of people are making things now for the spring like racing season as well. I think that would be really, really pretty. It's a stunning print. So that's the Mirage in the Cosette brand as well. So they are the four Cosette fabrics that we've had. So I'm really excited to mm -hmm. get those. We're also restocking, that's on its way right now, is the Lise Taylor Birdie print that sold out uh, within days when I had that, the navy background, a white bird print, and I'm getting some beautiful matching buttons to that as well. And there's also another Lise Taylor one coming with that. So that should be here within the week. We've also restocked our I'll linen and it. viscose blends. We'll just grab those. Now, a lot of you were waiting for this to be restocked. It was very popular. We sold out. Of the whole roll within a day when this first came mm, out. It's the beautiful, beautiful. isn't it stunning? Oh, that, I love this one. That yeah. one, that's the apricot and blossom. Now, remember last time I showed you guys, we'd already sold out this one, so I couldn't show you, but I'll show you in person. Now it's got a really nice sage, just so that sage green, olive green through it. There's mm. a few different greens, and it's got the really pretty apricot and floral, apricot blossom print, and that is 80% linen, 20% viscose. So these are direct from Europe and they are really soft and beautiful quality. I've had a couple of people come back and buy uh, a few different prints in this particular Monet's Garden collection in these lovely yeah, linen viscose. How soft beautiful. is it? Yeah. So when you crush them, normally a linen, you'll you'll see lots of creasing, but there's no creasing there. See, mm. it gives that softness. So um, 
Oh, I would love to see that in a beautiful uh, dress. Even the Soha 7 um, Wildwood dress, that wrap front is gorgeous. It would be something like this, would be lovely in a wrap dress. Uh, even a nice A-line skirt for someone with a white T-shirt, I think would be beautiful mm. too. So it's just a stunning print on its own, isn't it? Yeah, I love this one. That's your beautiful. favourite? Yeah. I think you better make something, don't you think? <laughs> <laughs> I keep saying to mum, if there's something you like, grab it because they go so fast. So, um yeah, love the weight. Really nice weight as well and not see-through at all. So definitely for anyone in the warmer climates, um, this is the fabric that you want to wear for especially heading into summer. And I do love wearing natural It feels fibers. so cool too. It does, doesn't it? Really soft and uh, it's got a lovely sheen to it. Next one, we've got a couple of newbies here. We've got um, this is a beautiful one and it's called uh, Amber Glow. It's got a really lovely rust, mm. fiery kind of, uh, I've got the elastic yeah, on there, fiery on. background. And it has a really pretty um, navy kind of leaf print through it, ferns and a kind of like a lily lily pad in the cream. Um, but that is a really stunning colour and I would love to see that in a wrap dress as well. Um, there's even a So House 7 Tea House dress that I love. Even your lipstick goes Yeah, I, I do love a bit of an orangey colour. I think they're really um, brightens you up. Yeah. Even, that, even that with a pair of denim jeans would be mm -hmm. nice because like a top, pick up that denim colour. Yeah, beautiful. So I'll show you guys up close, just the colour there. But, yeah, it's really nice when you can see things on screen, how the um, fabric falls and drapes and how it moves as well. So that's the Amber Glow. Mm -hmm. And all of these fabrics will be linked in the description box for you to find uh, easily as well. The next one that we had in a new print is the Petal and Pond, and it's another green. Look at that. Lots of flowers. That one <laughs> looks like an oil painting, like a 3D effect, doesn't it, for mm -hmm. the flowers? Um, that, yeah, it looks, yeah, it looks like it's been painted. It really does. Um, you can see like someone's got the palette knife and almost done the print it, the um, the flowers with the palette knife. But that, if you love greens, and I know a lot of you love greens and blues, I'm finding that. Um, I thought that one would be a beautiful one to add to the collection of linens and viscose. Mm. I think even with a uh, pair of uh, linen khaki <laughs> pants, those new Mitchell trousers from Closet Core beautiful. I've got a pair of... Um, dark green or olive green Pietro pants in linen. I think a top, like a shallow top, like a boxy top would be nice in that as well. Um, but it really mm. uh, yeah, it just depends on what you're after. But, yeah, definitely great for shirts, tops, dresses, just about anything. It's the right type of weight fabric that you can do just about anything with. And the last one in that collection is the Tranquil Lake. And this is a really unusual colour because... I don't often see really true like aqua blue mm, colours. Really stunning, isn't that it? That is so pretty with the pink, isn't that? Yeah. Really, really pretty, like a baby pink flower and quite a delicate, not an oversized mm. print either. It's um yeah, it's really quite soft and feminine, but definitely uh, a maxi dress and that would be beautiful. There's also a really nice caftan pattern called the Charlie Caftan from um Closet core patterns as well. It's an older pattern of theirs, but I want to make one of these. You can make it in a shorter length or the full length as well. I could really even see that. Um, it's one of those older patterns that I need to revisit because I know I made one years ago mm. and I loved it, and I don't know why I haven't made more. So I can definitely see that swishing around in that yes. Good for summer. Too. Very springy. It just gives me all the spring vibes. So that bit of pink, that pop of green, um, yeah, it's really, really pretty. So Beautiful. Definitely one that I would like to have in my wardrobe as well. So I hope you have enjoyed those new fabrics. Just a quick little uh, catch up today with fabrics. Yes. <laughs> so we've got uh, some new fabrics that will be arriving towards the end of the month as well. Some Nera to Hanson fabrics that are coming in. Um, they are taking a little bit longer to get here. But in the meantime, there's yeah, so many new fabrics in store there to hopefully get you um, a bit of inspiration happening. And you make sure that you all subscribe to the newsletter. That way you get, um, I let you know about fabrics as soon as they arrive. And also if there's any fabrics mm -hmm. that are out of stock that you've seen we've sold out of, please send me an email. I'm quite happy to try and source more for you and maybe put it aside 
um, because quite a few people did that with the linen uh, viscose prints. There was ones that they'd seen that we'd sold out of and I was quite happy to um, get more in and hold them aside so that way you will never miss out. Um, yeah, because a lot of these don't take too long to come in. I can quite easily access them you know, within a week or two as well. So uh, we've also got uh, a new collection of Lise Taylor prints that will coming in towards the end of November. So lots of new fabrics, um, yeah, to keep you all sewing for the festive season. Um, yeah, as I say, boxes will be going out this uh, the, towards the end of this week uh, and the start of the following week. And yeah, I can pop, quite happily pop any of these new fabrics in if you let me know and you can use that um, that code that I will have linked in the description box as well for you to add on any of those to you, what you've already purchased. Um, Advent calendars will be going out the last week of mm -hmm. October, first week of November. So we wanted to try and get those out to you. Yeah. Just in case postage e exactly. gets delayed. And also it starts getting really busy towards November. Yeah. I know a lot of you know that you need to get orders in uh, for Christmas. So um, you don't want to leave it too late. Yeah. So the next month's box will be in November will be a Christmas themed box. So we want to make sure we get that out um, mid November so that you'll get them before December as well. So there'll be a bit of a nod to Christmas. I won't tell you what the exact name of the theme is yet. Um, and we'll also be having a smaller box drop in December that will be kind of a nod to New Year's as well. So lots happening. I've got heaps planned for you guys, and I know that you're really enjoying seeing what themes we're coming up with yeah. well, you are. <laughs> I'm always asking mum what do you think what do you think we should you know what we should pick to go with this and that and um, she's very agreeable she just says whatever you think's fine yeah. <laughs> so um uh, yeah it's been really lovely and don't forget too um if you are purchasing things like labels I'm quite happy to send here in Australia in a, a normal envelope as long as they fit in an envelope and they're nice and flat and I will um send you back um postage differences that way or I'm even quite happy to add in another set of labels to make up the difference there um when I'm sending packages over to, to New Zealand of course um anything to do with packages even small packages are on a pretty basic um pricing so it's very hard to do anything under a certain limit. Mm. I think, yeah, small packages for express that attract start at like around $20. So I know a lot of people wanted to buy Mariflex thread um, and it's, yeah, it's quite expensive to pay for postage on top of that. So try and, um, yeah, if you buy the Mariflex, even if you pop it with fabric and it's under that certain weight, it will still be the same price. So it's always better to get better value yeah, for money with postage. True. So thanks for watching today. Mm -hmm. I hope you all have a beautiful week. And happy sewing. Yeah, happy sewing. I'd love to hear what's on the sewing table and I'd also love to hear what your favourite print was in that collection there today. So we'll catch up with you shortly. See you then. Bye, Bye for now. Bye.